My name is Ellen Franconi and I'm a senior consultant at RMI. I often work with clients to help them on their um, integrated design projects. I work with modelers to help them model better and frequently I've been working with um, on educational efforts to help get modelers up to speed more quickly. Energy modeling can be used to predict building energy performance. So often an energy modeler will work with a design team and they can predict what the energy used by the building will be. You can make comparisons between different design options and figure out which ones are most um, effective uh, for the design and climate being considered. The industry has gone through a lot of growth lately. People have started to realize the importance that modeling plays in trying to achieve some very aggressive energy efficiency goals that have been set forth for the nation for um, commercial and residential energy use. The market is growing exponentially. And with that, there presents challenges because energy modeling is a pretty specialized skill. It's not generally taught in a formal curriculum. So you learn it on the job and that can be effective, but it can also take a long time. And there's just not many modelers out there. For existing buildings, there is an opportunity to use modeling to help improve their operation and also to verify the performance of energy efficiency measures. Um, through this verification process, we can help show that these measures do save energy and that there are a good investment. Through the development of a master plan for the industry, we see that there's um, great potential to change the way um, business as usual is done. Many of the different organizations that will be attending have been well-intentioned in their efforts to improve modeling methods, but they have been operating as individuals or individual organizations, operating in silos, so to speak. And through this opportunity, we hope to have everyone come together with a shared vision that we can work on jointly.